Hey guys, it's the Solo Cloth and today so it's Monster Analysis video. We're going to be going over the brand new Monster Oni Kappa, and I'm going to be telling you guys whether or not he is worth getting out of the maze. So let's go and get right into it. All right, so Oni Kappa is a tank, and his traits are possession, immunity, sudden death, immunity, and taunt. Already, so right off the bat, he doesn't have Megaton, which is kind of a problem for tanks. Megaton is like the best thing tanks can have, and it's what all the good tanks have. And he only has a normal taunt, which is still decent, but it's not as good as Megaton. And then his relics are armor and shield, which are both really good for tanks. Then if we've gone down to his pros and cons, his great life and relics is access to two tortures and quicksands and toxins. He also has access to control immunity and control removal, and he has low cooldowns and stamina costs. And then his cons are no form of self-sustain, which can be a problem for a tank, definitely. He also has an abysmal trait except status caster, which is very true. Taunt is the only decent one there. And then he's easily denied by everything except for possession and trigger death. And then taunt is only an effect, so it can be removed very easily easily his awful speed blend move pool and nature in a fire meta so yeah a lot of those are really big problems now let's go on down to his move set so he has ally control removal with control immunity which is pretty good he also has self taunt and removes control which is pretty cool he has an aoe 30 nature damage with toxins and quicksands which is pretty cool and he has 40 nature with toxins and quicksands so he doesn't really do much and what he does do isn't really good for a tank he doesn't have any like self-sustaining moves he doesn't have heals or shields or anything which are things that tanks kind of need to be good so overall this monster just is not good at all he doesn't have a good trait he does doesn't have a good move set. His only really good thing is his relics, but those don't really help when you don't have anything else. So yeah, he's an okay monster, but not really good. I wouldn't go for him, especially since he'll probably cost money to get. So yeah, that is what we have for this video. Let me know down in the comments what you guys think of Oni Kappa though. And yeah, I see you on the next one. Roll like, share, and subscribe. Goodbye.